Otherwise, there are many people who recite the Quran daily, who fast, who pray all night. But when it comes to following the truth, when it comes to choose between right and wrong, for example, what happened in Karbala, they are unable to choose the truth. It's Surah Az-Zumar, verse number 18, and Allah says, Who listen to speech and follow the best of it? Those are the ones Allah has guided, and those are people of understanding. So here Allah is saying to Prophet, peace be upon him, that tell the believers, tell the people, tell the Muslims, that whoever listen a speech, for example, someone is explaining the verses of Quran, or someone is doing da'wah, someone is giving lecture about Islam, about the rules, laws of Islam. So the guided ones are those. They just don't only listen to them, but follow the best of it. It means they analyze what the speaker is saying and only follows that part which is right and true. So what Allah wants to tell us, He's saying that I will be with the one who follow the right thing, the right part, the truth, not whatever is said by the speaker. He may be speaking about Allah and His Prophet, but it's not necessary he's speaking the truth. So the guided ones are those who analyze it. He analyzes the statements of the speaker. Otherwise, there are many people who recite the Quran daily, who fast, who pray all night. But when it comes to following the truth, when it comes to choose between right and wrong, for example, what happened in Karbala, they are unable to choose the truth. This is their reality. This is the reality of such people who blindly follow the speech and do not have the ability to analyze the speech, to take good from it. If you have the ability to choose right and wrong, to choose the best part from the speech, then Allah will be pleased with you. He will be happy with you. He will guide you. And you would be among the guided ones that Allah has promised. So you need to take care of it. Otherwise, you would go astray. You would be misled. And at the end, you would be among them ignorance.